Good morning, everyone. I didn't know which one of these worked, so. Um, I just wanted to take a moment to welcome all of you and to thank you for the job that you do day in and day out for the children of Vineland. You guys are on the front lines every day, and as you know, we have a lot of students who have a lot of baggage that they come to school with every day. We deal with mental health issues, with family issues, and it's because of each of you in this room that we have been able to help many of our children in the Vineland School District. So I wanted to take a moment to say thank you for the job you do every day. Sometimes we forget to say that, but we want you to know that we really appreciate all that you do, and we're thankful that you're a part of our district. Um, our speaker is here, but before that, we're gonna do our awards this morning, and uh, after that, she will we'll take a little break, and then she'll be presenting. So we'd like to start by turning it over to Dina, and um, we're gonna get on with our presentation. Good morning, everybody. Welcome. Um, I just wanted to say it's been such an honor to work with all of you this year. And to start, we are going to start with our A-Team Excellence Award. And I am going to invite Madeline Milan up from Sabatier. Penny Smith to join me, Wendy Osborne, Regina Filmeyer.
next, oops, it's off. Next up, um, we're going to have Alex Nanahonger introduce our Child Study Team Case Manager Award. Hello, thank you. Um, normally our Special Education Director, Terry Godlewski, would come and speak at this event, um, but she's been dispatched on a top secret mission to somewhere in the southeastern portion of the United States. So as her second favorite special education supervisor I'm here. <clears throat> Before I introduce the Child Study Team Case Manager Award of Excellence, I too want to take a moment to acknowledge and thank all of you in this room for your sustained work and effort that you do every day. For many of our children, you are their advocate. They're, you are the one that they turn to when no one else is listening. The one who's pushed them to be more than what they realized they could be. The one who refused to give up on them because you saw something deep within. You do make a difference, and for that I want to thank you. The child study team member that we're nominating today has dedicated 25 years of service to the children of Biden. The nominators have identified her as the epitome of professionalism, teamwork, respect, and compassion. She's a resource for staff members and families conducts her child study team meetings where both parents and teachers feel welcome. She's always prepared for meetings, and she takes the daunting task of test interpretation to a level where parents understand and are able to contribute to the IAP process. This team member is often the go-to person when a family is in need of translation, or a colleague when you need someone's ear to bend. Her decisions are always made with the child in mind, and she abides by the social worker code of ethics in her daily practice. One peer described her as approaching every case with kindness and enthusiasm. So it is with great honor that I introduce Ms. Lydia Cruz as a 2018 case manager. Next, oh my goodness, let me get it right. There it goes. Finally, our last award, I'd like to invite Suzette DeMarchi to introduce our Starfish Award winner. Which is evident in all of her interactions. 
She is consistently helpful and extremely sensitive to all people she interacts with. Her work ethic is beyond reproach. She's typically the first one there every morning and the last one to leave. Her duties as department chair are extensive and she takes each one of her duties very seriously. The demands of her time and talents require her to be extremely organized and focused, and that she is. Her organizational, organizational skills keep the guidance department running smoothly, benefiting all of our students as well as her coworkers. She clearly works beyond what's expected. She is current in the field and adheres to the principles of the profession. Mrs. Bergamo services the high school population with an extensive knowledge base, particularly helpful to students as they head towards graduation. In summary, Mrs. Bergamo rises above the norm. She holds herself consistently to a high standard as a student advocate and professional school counselor. It is a pleasure to award Mrs. Beth Bergamo with the Starfish Award.